Hello friends, I am Dr. Prashant Sharma and you are watching Medico's Hub. In this video on dental anatomy, I am going to discuss the question right briefly on class, arch, set and type traits. First of all, class trait. These differentiate the teeth as one of the four types, incisors, canines, premolars and molars. Then second one is arch trait. These differentiate teeth on the basis of arch they belong. The teeth are either maxillary or mandibular on the basis of arch trait. If the teeth belong to maxillary or upper jaw, these are maxillary and if these belong to mandible or lower jaw, these are mandibular. Then third one is set trait. Set means these differentiate teeth on the basis of type of dentition they belong. We know that the human are diaphyodon and they have two dentitions. The first one is primary and another is permanent dentition. Then type trait. If the above traits are same, then further identification is done by using the tooth position that is either lateral or central or their number in sequence among the similar type of teeth like first, second and third. All the above traits help us to differentiate the various types of teeth and also give information about their structure and location. According to FDI tooth notation, if we take 5-1, then set is primary, arch is maxillary, class is incisor and type is central. So the general term used for such teeth is primary, maxillary, central, incisor. This is also ap applicable for 6-1. Now next is 7-4. Then set is primary, arch is mandibular, class is molar and type is first. So we can say that the common term or general term is primary first mandibular molar. This is also applicable for 8-4 which is in the same arch but in uh, opposite quadrant but at the same position. Next is 2-3. The set is permanent arch is maxillary, class is canine, there is no type because canine is single in one quadrant, so it will be termed as permanent maxillary canine. It is also applicable for 1-3. Then 3-8, permanent set, mandibular arch, molar is the class and type is third. So it is commonly termed as permanent mandibular third molar. The same is applicable to 4-8 which is present at the same position but in opposite quadrant of the same arch. So this is about the class arch set and type traits. Hit the like button, share and subscribe our channel to get the latest updates and notifications.